Diabetes can cost you a leg. Yep, your actual leg. But it doesn't happen overnight. Let's break it down, literally. Your leg has arteries, like flexible tubes, carrying fresh, oxygen-rich blood to muscles, skin, and nerves. No blood, no life. Now, imagine sugar acting like sandpaper. High blood sugar scrapes artery walls. The body tries to fix it by sticking fat and cholesterol on top, creating plaque. And boom, your arteries are narrowed or blocked. With less blood getting through, tissues get weak and nerves start to die off. It's called neuropathy. So now your foot is basically flying solo. No signals, no sensation. You step on a nail or a Lego, you don't feel it. No pain, no panic. And because blood flows poor, the wound barely heals, like trying to water a plant with a clogged hose. Bacteria crash the scene. Your immune cells want to help, but they can't get through the blocked roads. The infection grows deeper, nastier, fast. Tissue turns black, dead. At this point, doctors may have to amputate, not because they want to, but to stop the infection from spreading to the blood and killing you.